Okay, everybody, once again, mind the mess in the background. This is the first video showing of the Shindaiwa uh, C260. I wasn't sure what the model date was on this or the manufacturer date. Um, every single sticker on this thing is in mint condition, which is a real shock. 24.1 cc's. Let's see. Beautiful, beautiful unit. I mean, this thing is in mint condition for its age. I mean, come on primer needs to be i never saw something that has a primer on the fuel tank and then we got the fuel lines and everything it's going to get a carburetor probably i'm going to get an oem carburetor for it's going to be about 65 this strange primer is 25 absolutely gorgeous the sticker on here is in perfect shape almost Yeah, I know. I painted my nails black. Um, let's see. Take this cover off and show you underneath here. Some fuel cap. Got the handles. Look pretty good. This one's a little uh, loose. Of course, this piece is kind of cracked, but that's okay. Um, I'm going to get a new guard for it because it's like, you know, already so broken. And the trimmer head doesn't need to be replaced because the bottom piece is broken out of it. So, um, yeah, I would say uh, the guard is $40 and I will be buying it. The head I should have one that actually fits it. So, $40 down here. Probably going to be $65 on the brand new carb and I will have to get the new primer for it. So, primer bulb, carburetor, um, fuel lines, and the little stuff that I still have air filter because it literally fell apart when i took it out the guard new trimmer head yeah some money involved for sure but a beautiful beautiful old school piece like this it will definitely be saved but to tell you guys the truth i am running a little bit low on money because i've bought so much money i've bought so much uh, money's worth of parts before in the past and my bank account hasn't been building up that much kind of a personal thing but as you know that's kind of the reason so it's going to take me a little while considering that this thing is going to need about a little more than a hundred dollars worth of parts probably anyway i'm going to search around for stuff that might be a little bit cheaper but i can promise you one thing this thing is definitely going to be running one of these days so uh yeah that's the after result um pretty damn awesome